the clutch Cause their birthdays are the hardest to remember When you're born on Christmas The day before New Year's They can sing out their birthday But, but, but nobody hears it I was lucky I was born In the summer of 1975 It was as hot as an oven Families that were loving each other In November By April we're planning on their new family member Save one for the empirical boy With his empirical toys The Hot Wheels, the Autobots And the Decepticons And everyone's waiting to see what he's worth But he is invincible Like a breeze on the earth I was holding something In my hand so tightly I was afraid to let it go I was afraid to even know I was holding something cakes in the marketplace so this one is great what we like about this cake is it actually turns over and becomes if I can get it here a wonderful square punch bowl as well we have a beautiful trifle bowl soft square trifle bowl and also all of the other serveware pieces your tiered platters all with matching fluted loops that work beautifully with all of the glassware patterns as well as the dinnerware patterns. On this vignette we have two new dinnerware collections. Our first is dogwood, this lovely dogwood decal, which complements really, really nicely with Cornelia, which is a reactive glaze. Both of these patterns are offered in 16-piece sets, and we have them shown here with our new Reality drinkware, both rocks and teas. This is in smoke, which goes very, very nicely with the reactive glaze. And also our linden mocha, which pairs very, very nicely with the set as well. Annapolis glass dinnerware. We have it shown with our Annapolis white dinnerware. The Annapolis pattern was archive inspired. And here you can see the pattern detail. And it works very, very nicely with the the ceramic dinnerware. We have a full line offering our fountainware, drinkware, and also serveware. This is our Cream Isabella collection. It's a rather large collection. It offers all of the accessory pieces, the butter, sugar, salt and pepper, creamer, also a pitcher. It works very nice with our lovely little Isabella glass pieces. Uh, we have Isabella small bowls, large bowls into the platters. Um, also our trifle bowls and a chip and dip. Isabella is a collection I think that could work great for the holidays or for every day. It's a very traditional pattern. Here we have our Isabella dinnerware collection in white and it also coordinates nicely with our glassware. And here you can see a small dessert bowl, uh, which when layered, it just shows a beautiful statement on the table. So layering our 13 inch charger with our 10 and a half inch dinner plate, and then with our eight inch dessert plate and bowl, just really makes a beautiful statement on the table. 
We also have your serving ware pieces, serving platter, chip and dip, and also a trifle bowl. Also looks very, very nice and coordinates with our Isabella drinkware plat um, pattern. We have both a rocks and a tea in this pattern as well. This happens to be one of my favorite statements. This is actually pairing a little bit of land and sea together. Here we have our beautiful honeycomb cream statement and we have put it together with our cobalt glassware. How nice it looks, again, to put a mixed material as the ceramic together with the glass. Really, really shows a beautiful statement for the table. We've paired it with our facet uh, drinkware and we have a goblet, a rocks, not the goblet here. Really, really nice heavy base material with the faceted optic on the inside. So a beautiful statement for every day um, or for maybe a, uh, a, a seasonal getaway home. This is our citrus collection. It comes in four colors. Uh, what I love about this collection is the oversized bowls. We have large oversized bowls which are great, great for cereal or for soups. Again, um, there are three sizes of the bowls. Um, also the little dessert bowl which is so cute and a very, very large bowl which is great for fruit. All of the colors really complement together up the four, um, the four different um, collections which I really think is, is quite nice. And also what I really like about this is how great the packaging turned out. The packaging for Anchor Home Collection is just beautiful packaging um, which we are really, really excited about. And this is Marguerite. Uh, Marguerite dinnerware set complements our citrus um, avocado set perfectly. Um, they tie in very nice together. A uh, nice decal pattern, just a very happy pattern. Um, great for a breakfast or for a brunch. The mug is, is just beautiful, very organic in shape and feel, and just feels really, really great in the hand. This is our, um, our gray honeycomb, and yeah, paired again with our cream. We've showing it here with our eight inch plate with our honeycomb texture on the plate. How nice it looks when the reflection of the glass to the ceramic really looks great for a beautiful display. Also showing our 16 ounce beverageware tumbler, honeycomb beverageware with the optic on the inside and how great the glass looks uh, with the honeycomb comb plunger change. Also shown with our mugs. Again, another great shape of mug. Really, really nice handle, easy to hold, just really feels great in the hands. In this statement, we've taken an organic shape and we've taken two very, very soft colors. Um, Astrid Gray and a Daphne Yellow are the two colors and collection names that we put together for this. This is a very, very beautiful crackle glaze. The colors work really, really nice together, and we felt that it was really, really beautiful, uh, shown with our Ariana beverageware pieces, as well as our teardrop cake doll. This is our Steps dinnerware serveware collection. What we've done is we've taken our Rio, which is a very popular shape, uh, pattern of serveware and dinnerware for us, and we've done a plunger change um, to create the optic on the inside of both the bowls and, as well as the plates. So very, very beautiful plates and how this, we really are happy with how this turned out. The bowl sizes are great, the 8 inch is a perfect size for vegetables, perfect serving pieces, and the large fruit bowl is great and looks really beautiful on the table. We've paired it here with our Rio beverageware line. Uh, looks great with that, as well as our Rio mug. This is our baked display and collection. Really excited on how this turned out and to be able to bring six beautiful new SKUs to the line. We have our mixing bowls with wonderful design on the outside. A one and a half quart two and a half quart and four quart mixing bowl, as well as our loaf dishes in a one and a half, our eight inch cake, and our three quart bake. This pattern is archive inspired. We actually went into our archives 
and pulled out a pattern like this. And I really think if you could really take a look at these pieces and see what great quality they are, they're oversized, the oversized handles are great, um, as well as the packaging. It ties in with the bake program with the story of the New York City bakery, and it really ties two American companies together. In this section we have our food storage uh, with some fantastic colors. This is our splash proof bowl with a true seal lid great as uh, a serving piece, but also if you're finished serving and you want to put it away, a great lid and a great fit. Our embossed food storage, also with four very colorful lids, as well as our round embossed food storage. Again, the feel of these lids and the way they fit is just very phenomenal, and a great way to, we really as, uh, you know, as a nation to really take a look and, and make sure that we're, we're um, keeping our leftovers and storing them and really, really focus on not wasting as much food. I know that's an effort that everyone's making, but it's also great for these small little pieces for preparing applesauce, baby food, things like that, that we might want to keep and um, prepare ahead for us. I personally love this. This is one of my favorites, the mixing bowl uh, with lid, just fantastic cookies, anything, and then when you want to keep it in the refrigerator, just keep it there until you're ready uh, to use it. Our uh, measuring cups with our brand new design, uh, really, really uh, great, uh, fun little um, screen decoration. And then this has to be absolutely one of my favorites. This is our splash proof bowl, and it's a no skid base on the bottom. So really fantastic when you're mixing and measuring and it's not going to move on your on your tabletop counter. On this display we have our facet. Uh, facet comes in three sizes, our rocks, our tea, and our goblet. This is our aquamarine color. We also have our clear color displayed and we're showing them here with our specialty wine bottles. Uh, we have taken some um, little decorative um, ornaments and some corks and these are a, a product that we're going to be selling uh, to the Michaels, to the Hobby Lobbies of the world. Just a lot of fun. You're seeing this happen a lot on Pinterest and Etsy. So a great craft item. This is our chalkboard collection. Here we're showing our chalkboard collection as wine. We have a stemless wine, our red wine, our goblet, champagne, and a wine carafe. Over here we've done a beer statement. And here you'll see our refresher glass with a chalkboard deck. You can easily write a name, uh, whose name, whose drinking glass this is, or, or a fun comment, um, phone number, something like that. And here we have Linden, also decorated. And one of my favorites is the Heritage Hill chalkboard jar. Um, whether you show peanuts, cookies, whatever's inside can be there. And then we turn it also into a beverage ware and as well as dessert. Here we have our new 16 ounce uh, with a handle. And we are also showing our little baby Heritage Hill decorated. Our two gallon beverage ware dispenser, which is great for parties to show lemonade, water, tea, unsweetened iced tea is a great seller for us. Very excited to show our IJ Collins jar, which is going to be in stock in January. And as uh, many of you know, IJ Collins was the founder of Anchor Hockey. And then also our Montana jars, which shown here with the red lid, all three sizes of the Montana. Cafe mug, number one seller is our cafe mug. Have it with the chalkboard. And then another new introduction is the penny candy with the chalkboard lids. So you can say oatmeal cookies, keep out, or whatever you might like on, on the chalkboard lid. Our first pattern in our watercolor florals is Italian Cypress. It has a very simple banded dinner with a more decorative Tuscan colorway floral design on the salad. The eight people has a combination of the band and the floral, and 
The mug has a very sweet floral design that goes all the way around. Porcelain, dishwasher safe, microwave safe, um, a very warm colorway. <laughs> Our second watercolor pattern is Sakura Petals. This is also on porcelain. It's inspired by Japanese cherry blossom trees. It has a very simple design on the right hand side of the dinner and salad and then it sweeps across. And the same applies to the inside of the tea people. Our last watercolor floral is called Violet Enchantment. It's one of my personal favorites. It features a very simple purple orchid design with a very sweet butterfly um, on, both, on all pieces. Very simple, very elegant. And the purple design, purple color, really stands out on the white purple. Silver Ribbon is a more graphic floral. This is featured on our new bone body. It's actually a combination of porcelain and bone ash. It's about 4 to 5 percent bone ash. It gives it a slightly lighter feel and a much creamier color. This design features a very simple gray ribbon on the dinner and a people, but a more graphic and bold ribbon pattern on the salad. There will be a 45 match. This pattern is called Metallic Sketch. It's on our porcelain body. It's a more modern graphic floral, but what makes it so great is it's actually a metallic colorway. It's a Pantone, so it passes both uh, dishwasher and microwave safe, which makes it perfect for the ingredients. And on the it's a great combination of a geometric and floral. It's a very graphic red gold design on all pieces. Then complemented by this very kind of geometric and simple design. And this is on a porcelain body. I know, I know. The next pattern is called Grey Garden. This again is on our porcelain body, but what makes this so nice is a very simple but sophisticated floral design that just kind of peeks off the side. It gives a really nice updated look to a floral pattern. This is on our porcelain body. This is a much more masculine, uh, sophisticated pattern. It has a black band with a very geometric design over it. It has a very suit and tie inspiration. Four banded collections of the dinner has a very simple band with a more um, heavier band on the salad, bowl, and mug. We launched four different colors, our yellow, emerald, red, and blue. And our flatware trend for this October market is contemporary rustic. It's very um, rugged, imperfection, raw, natural. Our housewares in particular is more industrial inspired, where our fine is more of the natural elements of this rustic contemporary American folk uh, inspired trend. And we translated it differently with each of the six new launches. And that because we pushed the envelope in house layers, we had to focus on the higher price points of uh, 99 and 109, as well as introducing a new 79 99 20 set. Okay. So, so Forrester. Forrester is our 109.99 launch, and Forrester is a forged pattern with a first to market <laughs> deep glass oxidation finish. Uh, this pattern is inspired by traditional cutlery handle. It has the faux rivets on both the front and the back of the handle. Um, and this fits in with our contemporary rustic theme that's launched both in fine and square. Okay, so Ironwood is a modern take on the very popular beaded patterns in the housewares. Usually the beaded patterns are on a round body, where this is a rectangular shape and an updated beaded look um, with exposed nail head inspiration, putting in with that industrial rustic trend. Okay, McKinley is another $99.99 launch. It's very rugged and um, inspired by the mountainous terrain. It has a brush finish over the um, terrain decoration. 
Okay, continuing with the $99.99 launches, we have Tindra, which is branded at the bottom with a rustic star. This rural star is seen throughout the countryside on many um, farmhouses and barnyards, and we um, added that crisp star at the bottom of a clean, round, rounded shape, again fitting in with the rustic trend. Okay, Cooper starts our new launch of a first for Oneida. It's a 20 piece set for $79.99. These patterns are forged and added decoration and finishing, creates a higher price point, and we are creating competition for gourmet settings, who are the only ones out there right now with this look and price point at 20 piece sets. Cooper is a um, Copper cookware inspired pattern with the faux rivets on the back of the handle. It looks like a two piece construction, yet it is um, one piece with a pierced hand, uh, pierced, piercing at the bottom of the handle and a fully brushed um, piece. And I noticed you pierced the knife in this too. Is that unusual? Uh, yes, that is rare, for, especially for 18 0 housewares uh, collections. <laughs> Okay, Raven is a very heavy gauge of 5055. It's a forged pattern, so it's very dimensional. It has a fully oxidized handle, which is unique for the housewares collection. Um, they have a, also a unique working end. The breaking plane goes a little deeper with very wide working ends. Same for the dinner fork as well. And um, these are first samples, so the oxidation will go a little bit higher. And there's also a unique detail at the back of the working end, which we hope to also oxidize as well. Cheers. In Oneida Fine Flatware, we are launching five new sets with one relaunch, um, Colossus. Colossus is a 4045 gauge and that had a lot of success last October, no placement, so we thought we'd relaunch it. The other five patterns fit in with our contemporary rustic theme for this flatware launch. Okay, Fiorella is one of our cleaner new fine set launches. It's inspired by soft rippling in uh, by a water droplet and it's a 3035 gauge. Okay, Vinca is inspired by vineyards and there's a soft trailing vine at the bottom of this clean rounded sandal. Uh, this pattern is a 3035 gauge. Mirror finish. Okay, Colossus is a relaunch from last October. There was no pickup, but a lot of interest in this pattern. It's sort of a take on Voss, which is our best-selling housewares. We took it into fine with a more classic version with the detailing at the tip and the straight lines at the side, but with the scooped handle. And it is a heavier of the fine sets. It's a 4045 gauge. Okay, Sirius is a clean modern pattern with an asymmetrical handle that fits in a biomorphic natural trend. Uh, this pattern is a 3035 gauge with a fully mirror finish. Glenwood seems to be our most popular pattern this launch with a brushed handle and mirror working end. It's inspired by a wire wrapping or natural wood grain. Um, this pattern, this look is seen in the bridal five piece play setting and Oneida will be the first one to take it to the 65 piece set. And this is also 3035 gauge. Odessa is another clean modern launch that can match back to any table setting and the inspiration behind this pattern is Polished stones and it has a 3 to